Kelly Ripa acknowledges on live that she's irritated after Mark Consulos refers to her as a chihuahua. Being a talk show host can be tough at times. On live with Kelly and Mark, Kelly Ripa lost it again when Mark Consulos made a dog-like comparison to her. Mark, 52, started reading aloud a list of expressions that people can use instead of pretending to agree with someone, which sparked the tense conversation between the couple. Kelly, 53, gritted her teeth throughout the segment, which aired on Thursday, January 25th, and was clearly agitated. The Riverdale actor teased Kelly, saying, You're getting mad already, in between reading passages from the paper. Kelly responded, I'm not gonna lie. I find this annoying. I hear you, though I have a different opinion and I understand your viewpoint, but I see it another way where a couple of the statements that Mark listed. Kelly finally lost her temper and told her husband to go ahead, keep going. You can count on me to disagree with you because I'm superior to that. At the news desk, the Emmy winner sat with her arms crossed. Right now, under the table, your leg is going crazy. You resemble a tiny chihuahua. As the audience erupted in laughter, Mark spoke. When Mark won a game of Stump Mark earlier this week, Kelly referred to him as gross as he made a victory lap around the table. The former pitch employee has been having a rough time lately in the daily trivia segment because he has been going through an embarrassing losing streak. On January 19th, Mark remarked, I need like an exorcism or something, following his defeat in the well-liked live game. He was able to break the pattern on Tuesday, January 23rd, when he recently won, running around the set in celebration. Viewers have found live to be enjoyable to watch every morning, and the show has garnered impressive ratings since Mark officially joined as a co-host in April 2023. When Mark and Mr. Feelgood first started dating in December 2023, he advised them to find someone that you enjoy walking on the beach with, talking about the future, about what you want. We still do that now, as we did when we were 24 years old. Like, it would be amazing if we could accomplish this.